Mike Hughes here. I'm at St. Vincent and the Grenadines, and I'm here with Vaughn. And you want to tell us a little bit about the island? All right. Um, or islands? Island, yeah. We're, <laughs> we're actually, um, St. Vincent is the mainland, and oh. we're an island with 32 other small, you know, um, chain of islands. Down, right. You know, um, on the coastline and so on. So we have lots of um, different diversities of diving that you could do from okay. marine parks to your um, wall dives, direct dives, you know. Drifting. Right. So it's a lot and the dive sites are quite close to the mainland, just about five, ten minutes away from your dive Five, ten minutes away. Yeah. So you can dive it and get back for lunch. And get back or, for lunch. So, uh, or dive and get back for lunch. Diving is like we start at nine, you do two dives and we're back by midday. Okay, so yeah. breakfast first and then we dive. Yeah, well, not too heavy a breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right. and uh, cool. So you can get um, several dives a day, and then yeah. there's night diving as well. Night diving. Uh, right off of shore. Yep. Okay, and and yeah. then your boat. Um, how many you? How many dive sites do you have in the 32 islands, or did you just on, quit on, on, counting? On, we just quit counting. On the <laughs> mainland itself, you have over over about you know 40 something plus dive sites. Right. Right. We have three operators on mainland uh -huh. right so you have those who have like two or three boats so you take a, a lot more persons and then we have the smaller dive shops like myself who concentrate more on the personalized touch okay right? so six eight divers you know keep it nice and fun right um, and that's serenity dive that you're yeah, with serenity dive and then the other ones which are down the islands like mm -hmm. beckway down the grenadines they have their own dive shops as well okay so um so you have an option of going down there and diving with them as well. And now, what's yeah. the what's the most popular dive for the tourists that come in? Um, a lot of them like the wall dives. Wall dives? Yeah. Um, okay. And then there's actually um, a wreck dive, wrecks. Uh -huh. There's actually one wreck, wreck dive, but there's three wrecks on that same dive. So you oh. hit the three wrecks in the same dive. Okay, are they kind of roped together or something? They or? actually was landed together. Okay, on purpose. Yeah. yeah. So you have one that starts in about 100 feet, right? Um, which we usually go to the deepest one first, okay? And then we come up to the 80 yeah. foot one, and then right. we go up to the 40 to 50 foot one. So you're moving so your way up, moving getting way up. Rid, of way, rid of the excess nitrogen. nitrogen yep. And all that's in one all swoop. Within about 45, 50 minute dive. Oh, when we're doing that. sweet. Yeah. Okay. Cool. And. Um, now, people come out there, do they usually spend a week out there or what? Usually a week. Yeah, okay. But we, of course, just like everyone else, you have your kids you know, drop in diver who may be just there for two or three days. So they uh -huh. just want to get a dive in. Right. You know, but yeah, we do the packages, all the dive shops do like, um, you know, a seven day, um, seven night, um, you know, package. Right. So you have five days of dive in. And yeah. And the last day you're off, yeah. So we might probably do a lionfish cookout for you. Oh, you there know, you go. go while we're diving, we spare them, uh -huh. clean them, and then we have a cook on the last day. So. And you can never get ahead, can you? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> That's good because there'll always be a lionfish feed. There's always, yep. <clears throat> no, actually, we do um, a fish fry at the last Friday in every month. Okay. Where we drain our time, like two weeks before that, we'll go and catch at least three to four hundred lionfish. Oh my goodness. Uh, we, Drop we in the bucket. Yep. Um, we have been wow. able, on the dive sites, there's kind of under control because that's where we would always have an eye out but uh, the areas that we don't normally dive that's where we would you know oh yeah find them. um we've noticed that some areas um now we'll have to go much deeper than we used to, to go get them yeah before it was basically around the 40 to 60 foot range right right but now we sometimes we have to get to like 100 so oh that's interesting they're yeah. learning yeah and then we find them in the grassy beds too Oh wow! Yeah, so they're not just in reefs as before. They've yeah. they've learned to diverse. Yeah, yeah. So oh, that's go interesting. Where the little fishes are. So yes. Yeah, but more interesting, you know, it's more fish for us. So yeah, mm -hmm. so we've made that into a business. So. Okay, and if they want more information about um, your dive shop, well, where would they go? Serenity Dive at Hotmail, or we have a. Um, if you want to drop me a line, a uh -huh. message, or you could we have a Facebook page. Uh -huh. and our website is www.serenitydive.net. Serenitydive.net. Perfect. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure. I thank Santa. 